Today, I am going to be showing you guys the trailer for episode 16, which is entitled Time Bomb of The Flash Season 5. Now, with that being said, you know, if you're not yet caught up with any episodes of The Flash this season, do not watch any of my videos. Now, this isn't a review for an episode. This is just a live reaction to a trailer that was released, uh, you know, a couple hours prior to the episode airing last night. Now, we do know that this trailer isn't my own trailer. I don't own the footage. This was provided by TV Promos on um, YouTube. So you guys can go to that channel and check the trailer out for yourself. Now, this trailer is very short, but there is a little bit of things to go over in it. So I'm going to do a live reaction with you guys and then just give you my thoughts on it and any other information I might have. Now, with that being said, I am going to start this video. But before I do, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel right now for more videos like this. Smash that like button if you're a fan of The Flash and of my channel. And just smash that like button just because it would do very much good for the channel and it would do good for my self-esteem. Now, with that being said, I am going to put this on full screen and I am going to play this short trailer for next week's episode. Whoa, I disappeared for a second. Oh, I'm back. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. Secrets are like walls. Secrets are like walls. Really oh, we have the chair back. Between you. This should all be over. It's too late. Look at mm. Tell your father. Tell your father everything. Wow. As I said, you know, very short trailer, but we do have some stuff to discuss in this trailer. So, Team Flash, they ultimately failed. They were supposed to take down Cicada, and they did relatively, you know, due to the cure that was administered to him. So they took down that Cicada, and now they have a problem because they have a Cicada from the future. Now, if you guys haven't noticed, this Cicada is very much different from the Cicada that they just cured. This Cicada apparently has the powers of the dagger without actually even holding the dagger. Now, have you guys seen that very second half, you know, last, what, six minutes of the episode in which the new Cicada just like, just went supernova and just destroyed Star Labs. They were able to hold back Team Flash, deflect all the powers of Team Flash, and just this Cicada was very much OP, you know, just very overpowered. And Team Flash was not ready for this. They were not prepared for this to happen. And this is the cause of them taking too long to take down Cicada. Barry wanted to talk to him and do this, that, and the third. Then it was numerous times where they let him escape, which they made me extremely upset. They made me extremely upset because every time... They come across him. They want to have a conversation with him. They don't have the dampening cups on hand. If he's not going to listen to anything you have to say, you know, bring his ass in. Why you keep letting him escape? And he keep coming back with different powers. Now we've seen that he had a force field in the last episode. He developed that out of pure energy, you know, against Acid Master. And I'm like, you know, at this point, how much more stronger can he get? But... He takes the cure. They have him in Star Labs. He's sedated. You know, he's knocked out or whatever. He's trying to heal. Um, he's pretty much cure of his metagene. He's not a threat anymore. But boom, in comes another cicada from the future. The guys on the team, they're looking at each other like, how is that possible? He's laying right here on the stretcher bed. And... You know, us as the fandom, we know this is definitely a different cicada and it's from the future. And it looks female because of the body build. And when she reveals herself, it happens to be a future version of Grace. Now we see the huge gash in her head. So we do put two and two together. This is Grace from the future. And if you guys remember from that um, that dream episode um, where they went into each other's conscious, when Nora entered the mind of Grace, she was in fact Cicada 
you know, so that's where that comes from. You know, it's a possibility that maybe she was meant to be the original version of Cicada. Who knows? It's the writer's fault that they send us down these roads. Um, but back to this trailer, you know, um, Team Flash is just baffled. They don't know what to do now, you know, and Nora is just like, wow, I'm screwed, you know, so if I go back to reverse Flash, I want to see if he can help me. And he's just like, you know what, your time is up. And as you can see, the ticker is down to 11 minutes and however many seconds, but initially they are going to fail. She came back for this specific reason, I guess, to stop Cicada. And then they're going to, you know, find a way to stop the crisis from, you know, making Barry disappear or whatever. But initially their plans failed because she didn't follow, you know, exact instructions that were provided by Reverse Flash. Now, he has stated to her in, I don't remember what it, episode exactly, but he mentioned, you know, I am the only one that actually knows what he is doing, you know, and here you go. Once again, proving his point, you guys messed up and now he's screwed and you're screwed because there's a very chance that she can die. Reverse Flash will probably be let out of his cube and maybe he'll die as well or whatever the situation is. Maybe he's going to be administered a cure or maybe he's getting executed and he was trying to prevent that. Who knows? But the plan that him and Nora has put into action has ultimately failed. Team Flash has failed their city, you know, and it's just, it's just hilarious. Um, then we have the voiceover of Eobard Thorne saying, you know, tell your father, tell your father everything because he knows that the plan has failed. So, you know what? Put me out there. Say that you was working with me, you know, and... I was the one that sent you back in time to, you know, allow you to run again with your father, run again with the Flash and, you know, be with your mom, be with a different version of your mom. You know, I gave you all this clues and hints on how to stay, you know, within the timeline, which, you know, proof once again that he's proven that he is, you know, one of the smartest men, if not the smartest men in the Arrowverse. Um and he's very clever, you know. Um, but once again, you know, like I said, you know, he's just proving that, you know what, I am who I am. You know, tell your father everything. It's nothing he could possibly do to me because we know that Barry Allen doesn't kill. And that's something that he stated, you know, in the crossover numerous times. You know, you can't defeat me, this, that, and the third. And it'll be interesting to see what Barry's going to do. You know, he had little tears in his eyes. Um I'm guessing she told him everything. You know what? The reason why I'm here is because of Reverse Flash. I didn't know to come here on my own. You know, he coached me. He did this, that, and the third. So, you know, that kind of upset Barry in a way. You know, how could you work with my greatest enemy? You know, so we should find out a lot of information within this episode in which how Grace has become Cicada, you know, and how she was able to travel back to this time period and, like, who helped her, you know, because... We do know that the time sphere needed, you know, a speedster to, you know, project it into, you know, the speed force to allow it to travel through time. So it should be interesting. It should be very much an informative origin kind of episode of Grace, you know, future Grace, that is. And I'm looking forward to it. You know, um, this cicada definitely is much more badass, you know. And if they thought they had a problem with the regular cicada, this cicada from the future is just far beyond. And <laughs> that's probably a future pun, you know, write that down in the comment section if you think it is. But anyway, with that being said, let's look forward to this next week's episode, which is entitled Time Bomb. This promo video was brought to you by the CW and it was provided by TV Promos. YouTube channel. So you might want to go check that channel out, guys, if you want to see this trailer over and over again without my commentary. And with that being said, make sure you subscribe to my channel, hit that bell and smash that like button. I'll see you guys in the next one.